Motor Week, television's original automotive magazine. Brought to you by Castrol Super Clean All Wheel Cleaner. The cleaner that releases brake dust and road grime from all types of wheels on contact, no matter what age your car. Castrol Super Clean All Wheel Cleaner. And by Michelin, makers of the Zero Pressure Michelin. Designed to let you drive up to 50 miles at 55 miles per hour without air pressure. Just what you expect from Michelin. Your host for Motor Week, John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week. We're glad to have you with us. Luxury car buyers have always been demanding. And as car sales shift from sedans to sport utility vehicles, these well-heeled folks are getting tougher to please. Take the situation of Toyota and its luxury brand, Lexus. Like many manufacturers, Toyota responded to the demand for luxury sport utes with a fancier version of its big, tough Land Cruiser. They called it the LX450. But while many customers like the big LX, a lot of them demanded a machine that was smaller, quieter, and a real Lexus. So Toyota gave the go-ahead for Lexus to build a new compact RX 300. It's not like anything else in the Toyota lineup. But is that enough to make this a real Lexus? While the 1999 RX300 is different in form, it remains fervently true to the Lexus philosophy. Upon close inspection, it's quickly evident all the qualities that make Lexus a standout in the luxury car segment are also found in this new SUV. Starting with the crystal clear aerodynamically wrapped parabolic headlamps and projector fog lamps that flank a bold vertical barred grill, all fronting a profile remarkably similar to that of the Mercedes M-Class, although the RX 300's roofline is nearly five inches lower. The slightly flared wheel openings and 16-inch tires on alloys give the RX a look of civilized ruggedness, while the multi-light theme continues at the rear with oversized lenses extending into a single-piece hatch with standard wiper washer. Smooth performance is also part of the Lexus legacy. Standard 3-liter quad cam 24-valve V6 launched us to 60 in a very fine for an SUV 8.6 seconds. We passed the quarter mile in 16.6 seconds at 83 miles per hour. Pumping out 220 horsepower and 222 pound-feet of torque, this Camry-based power plant is the only one offered in the RX 300. But with new features like variable valve timing with intelligence, a three-stage variable intake system, and an active engine mount that cancels vibration at idle, it's the only one you'll need. It feeds through an electronically controlled four-speed automatic transmission that delivers seamless shifts and full-time four-wheel drive through a viscous center differential. Like most carborne SUVs, there is no low range, but there is an optional Torsen limited slip rear differential on 4x4 models. On 4x2s, traction control is available. But despite having 7.7 .7 inches of ground clearance, the Unibody RX 300 isn't a boulder hopping, tree climbing SUV, and it doesn't pretend to be. It is, however, the most refined SUV we've tried. Indeed, out on the highway, the RX's manners are impeccable, and it's readily apparent why this SUV wears a Lexus badge. The four-wheel independent McPherson strut suspension tenders a ride that is soft and compliant without being excessively so, even when encountering the uneven surfaces so prevalent on secondary roads. A trip through the slalom showed the RX can be pushed more aggressively than most truck-type sport utes. A modest amount of understeer was evident on turn-in, but lateral transitions were smooth even with a fair amount of body roll. Alas, the rag and pinions power steering pump couldn't keep up with our most rapid switchback movements. But there was no twitchy movement under heavy braking, as the ABS-equipped four-wheel disc brakes hauled us in from 60 in a very stable 127 feet stable and comfortable. And with ample wood trim, the RX 300's interior looks 100% Lexus. The optional leather upholstery covers wide seat bottoms and backs that are plush but supportive. Seat mounted side impact airbags are standard. Step in height is very low and with 10 way power adjustment on the driver's seat, just about any and all driving positions can be found. The thickly padded tilt wheel faces a crescent shaped IP that houses the gauges backlit with the excellent Optitron lighting system. The lighting doesn't work so well with the LCD screen in the center stack, however. Displaying stereo climate and trip computer functions, it easily washes out in sunlight and proves more distracting than helpful. 
too bad since the 190 watt sound system delivers superb sound and an optional glove box mounted six disc CD changer. Also, the controls are awkwardly divided between the faceplate and the bottom of the LCD screen. Fortunately, the climate controls are right where you need them and self-explanatory. The shifter is close at hand, too, as it's mounted in the upper half of the RX's odd two-piece console. A switch activates the winter and power shift modes. The split arrangement leaves a bit of crossover footroom in front of a well-executed floor console that has almost as many compartments as a steamer trunk. Equally spacious are the comfortable rear seats with nearly five inches of fore and aft travel. There's plenty of hip and shoulder room for two adult occupants. Now Lexus claims three, but we wouldn't want to be the one in the middle. The 60-40 split seat backs recline and fold forward to create additional room for the rather smallish cargo bay. Prices, while certainly not smallish, are quite reasonable when considering the level of content and the Lexus mark. Base price on 4x2 models is $32,045, with 4x4s starting at $33,445. Our 4x4 tester totaled out to $38,603. And it's that price-to-content ratio that tops our list of hits, followed closely by the refined ride and handling, clever center console, and the glove box mounted CD changer. Misses are the obtrusive LCD screen, awkward stereo controls, and small cargo bay. The 1999 Lexus RX 300 takes the concept of combining car-like manners, wagon versatility, and all-wheel drive safety and utility, an idea made popular by the Subaru Legacy Outback, and pushes it to a new posh extreme. It's such a no-brainer that the RX 300 is almost guaranteed to be a success. And yes, it is a real Lexus. Coming up, car shopping by computer.